So hello, this is Pam from Earthworks and just finished up a project here in Jacksonville that I, I, again, I had the most wonderful clients and I really enjoyed working with Candy here, the homeowner. And she and I, she had um, opinions about what plants she liked and what plants she didn't like. So I put together a plan for her and then we went over the plant list and she added what she wanted to see. And then I told her what would work, what wouldn't work. And so we worked really well together as far as just giving her landscape a refresh. Again, it was just old, overgrown, and very like it didn't do anything to the curb appeal of her home so we really didn't change the bed lines or anything we just like she's got this big beautiful maple here in the front so we just kind of added some fresh mulch around that we ripped out a few of the old pittosporum that are over there they were just kind of looked really small and scraggly and leggy so we just removed a few of them kept the other ones added a few new ones there and then just along the house we basically just added a little height to the end and she wanted stuff that's really simple pretty much to take care of. She likes to do a little gardening, so hence we've got roses, we've got some hydrangeas, but for the most part she really just likes simple plants that will kind of do their job as I like to say. So we've really just added some blue days, some pentas, some laurel petulums which we added to the current laurel petulums that she already has. And we did some low grow Pringles in front of the windows, but we did some taller Mackies on the sides of the house because she does have beautiful brick walls. It just kind of accents those walls with the height in, in front of them. On the ends, we put just a few Brodies because they're evergreen, they don't lose their leaves. They just always look beautiful and they, glow, they grow fairly slow. So that's something she won't ever have to worry about pruning. The other thing that we added that I really thought was great was the little Robolini in the front because she has a beautiful established double Robolini in front of this window. So we went with just a small single in front of the other window, which she just really liked that little touch of tropical. So overall, it was a seamless project. The guys did a great job. Um, they were really easy for them to work with as clients. And the install went very smoothly. Everything looks great. And then I always like to go back at the end of the project a few days after they've they've lived with it for over the weekend and a few days and just kind of do a final walkthrough with the client and just say, so what do you think? Do you have any areas of concern? Uh, we make sure that the plants are looking good. And then the one, like for example, the one thing that she noticed is the area behind the Robolini, she thought just looked a little uh, bare compared to some of the others. So we're just going to bring in a few of the, the plants from the, on the opposite side, the color of those violet pentas. We're just going to bring those over just to kind of balance that front entrance out a little bit more, which I thought was great, especially since it was her idea. And so I'm going to bring those back myself and install them for her. And other than that, everything looks great. So I think they're happy. I would, a fun project to do. And if there's something that you would like to refresh in your yard, whether it's a front yard, a backyard, you know, the entire property, just, you know, give me a call. I'd be happy to put something together for you, work with you collaboratively, you know, give your house refresh and add some beautiful new curb appeal.